I'm here in Samoan at the location of the new project Septentrion, your promise for sale just on the outskirts of the village. Samoan is a really special place for me. It's where I chose to live from 2009 for three years. I really got to know the village, the people, did a lot of exploring. And one of my favorite things is this, the Kriu. It's 2,200 meters rising straight up out of the valley. And just behind it, you have one of the deepest caves in the world. It's called the Gouffre Jean Bernard. If you like mountain biking, someone has got some amazing trails and one of them is in this forest, which is called the Sue. And it's also linked to the Bourgeois mountain. So you can ride right off the top of that pinnacle, just behind the hotel, all the way down into the center of Samoan. And on the Bourgeois, you have the Col de Joux plan and a road linking Samoan with Mozi. So the Grand Massif is neighboring with the Pot de Soleil. So you have the option of skiing both domains if you invest here. The valley itself is extremely flat, so the plot is on a flat piece of land and it's a very low valley, 720 meters altitude, which is fairly low by alpine standards. But I really love that because you get the low altitude living, there's less snow to clear, there's, you know, you get the spring sooner, it's a little bit warmer, it's easier to move around, especially by bike or on foot, than some of the higher resorts which aren't as flat in the valley. So I really like that. And it's only a two or three minute walk into the center of town. Or you can take the ski bus directly to the Grand Massif Express, which goes up through that forest there, up to Samoan 1600. And then from there, you can take a chairlift to the Tete de Se. And then you can easily drop into Lake Row, which is great for tree skiing. You can traverse around to Flen, which is high altitude, open skiing, lots of amazing runs over there. And from Flen, you can ski all the way down into Six Forest Cheval on a famous piece called the Cascades, Blue Piste. And in Sixth, there is a route up to the Cirque de Fercheval, which they call the Boudemonde, and it's an incredible place. It's got waterfalls pouring down into it. Very, very spectacular, like something out of Lord of the Rings. And up over there to the east, you can see Mont Bure, which is a massive mountain up above 3,000 meters altitude. Speaking of which, Mont Blanc is just behind the pointy mountain, which is called Poix de Salle. So in the summer, you can actually hike over to the Brevon from someone it takes about six seven hours over Lac Dantin and you can drop down into Chamonix. So exceptional place both in winter and summer. The village itself is really charming. It's renowned for its stone masonry. So it has lots of nice monuments and buildings, architecture, very nice restaurants, bars, shops, cafes, plenty of expats but really well integrated with French, some Dutch people, some Swedish, Belgians. So it's a really good eclectic mi mix of people and lots of opportunities for children as well. Just over there, you have the Boire Dam man-made lake, which has lots of sports and activities around it. There's many events in the summer. The beautiful river Gifre running down the valley. And yeah, honestly, the views in this valley are exceptional and ever-changing with the seasons and the different light. I now live over in Morzine, but if I was reinvesting, someone would be very high on my list of possible options and as you can see in the sky it's a hot spot for paragliding and you can do tandem flights from the top of the crew all the way down into someone.